Hello, students and families of Great Latrobe School District. My name is Mr. Bowlby. I'm one of the three elementary art teachers at Great Latrobe. And the goal of this video is to show students and parents how to upload pictures of finished artworks in the Google Classroom. You may be aware that we recently moved away from emailing lessons and assignments to uh, moving the art class into the Google Classroom. When you log into your Google Classroom, you might see many more classes than this, but right now I'm pretending to be a sixth grade student and I'm gonna open my sixth grade art class. There's an assignment here waiting for those students. And if I open this assignment, of course, I'm gonna see the directions for the project here. And over on the right, if you bring your eye over here, is this area called your work. This is how we can upload pictures of our finished work but before we do that, a picture of the project must be on the computer. I've got a few ways for us to do that. And the first way, if you have a Chromebook or a computer with a webcam, is to use that camera built into the computer to take a picture of your work. If you have a Chromebook, the way that you'll do that is to come down here to the launcher. You can type in the word camera in the search, that will help you find the camera app. And when you open the camera app, you'll see yourself at first. I'm then going to hold up a picture of my work sneaking around the side here so I can see what I'm doing. Take one or two to be safe. When you're done with that and close out the camera app, you now know that those photos are on the computer. So I can now search for a file to add, I'm going to select this bar in the middle called Select Files from your device. And when this window opens, I can see those photos right here of the pictures that I took. Now, it might involve spending a little time over here. Maybe that picture ended up in images or in your downloads. I'm not quite sure. But the ones from my Chromebook camera ended up right here. I'm going to select one of those. I'm going to open it and upload. Once it uploads, you do need to take one more step, and that is to click this black bar to turn in, and it will ask you to confirm that. And I have now turned in my assignment. While stating that you can use the Chromebook camera, I do wanna say I'm aware there are so many different ways to get a picture onto a computer. One of the ways I do that in my personal life is to email it to myself. You may know that outside email accounts are unable to send um, email messages and, and attachments to student accounts. But if you are able to log into an outside account on that computer, you could simply download it from an email. One of the ways I get the e pictures to a computer is to email them to myself. So now I know that image is on the computer as well. I could go back to the Google Classroom and download that now. I'm also aware of air dropping photos. Um, I'm hearing that some families have a digital camera and they're removing the SD card to get them onto the computer. Um, I'm also aware that uh, some families are using the cord of their digital camera. There's a lot of different ways to get the picture onto the computer, but once it's there, you'll simply use this area called My Work to find that file and submit it. I'm going to unsubmit this now so that you can play along with me in the Google Classroom app. You may be aware that there is an app for the Google Classroom out there. I downloaded this app in the Google Play Store. If somebody in your family has a smartphone and is able to do this for the student account, you would simply type in the login information. Their classes would be listed here. And this is that same sixth grade class. I'm going to open that class, find that same assignment. The directions are up top here, and at the bottom is that same area called Your Work. If I open Your Work and click Add Attachment, one of my favorite parts of the app is that it actually gives me the chance to take a photo right from the app. So I'm going to click Take a Photo here. I'm going to lay my artwork out, take a photo of it. It's going to ask me if that's OK. And then I do have to do that last step with the black bar there and turn it in and confirm. I think that the app is very easy to use. 
I love that it just gives you that option right from the phone to take a photo. Um, I think that that's a little quicker than doing it on the computer, but the Chromebook camera was also very easy to use. And so that image is now uploaded and I'm just going to turn it in. One more time, boys and girls and parents, this is not something that we are requiring at this time, but all art teachers are highly suggesting that students and parents get familiar with this process in case the school, school closure is extended we would then be asking families to submit pictures of finished work that way. Thank you for watching.